Okay. So my name is Pete Calgas, coach of defensive tackles. Um, some keys for uh, through this spring in that position is uh, dominant three techniques that uh, are leading fast, violent with hands, and defeating blocks. Uh, at, the, at the no spot, it's going to be the same thing. It's going to be taking on those doubles, which you're going to get doubled all the time. And that's where Lucy and, and Chase and the guys in the tilt or even in a G need to do a great job of pounding that A gap and holding the A gap. And then the other thing that we're going to work on to make sure that they work on this spring is just run to the ball. they got to run and, uh, and chase. How, how do you think your depth is? I mean, I know we're just one day into spring, but how do you think your depth is? at the defensive tackle spot as, as we go into spring? Tough to say right now. You know, first day of sweats, and there's going to be a lot of development. And that depth's going to increase from what they do in the weight room also. Uh, coming up throughout this offseason, looking at it right now, I really can't answer that question until we get pads on a little bit farther. Mm -hmm. You know, real quick, coach and defense, you've coached offensive line and running backs here and coached offense a long time. How does it feel to be, be, be on that side of the ball with, with the defense? feels good to be on the defense. Actually, it just feels good to be back in the trenches. It really does. Don't get me wrong. I love the running backs. I love the young men I work with. Rick and me. And Brandon Miller and all those guys. But it's nice to be back in the trenches and just hand-to-hand -hand combat. And it's, that's where all the, this war's done. There's no glory in it, but that's where it's done.